What's up guys and welcome back to Ukulele and today we're gonna be continuing on with of course the game now I just sort of loaded the game up and we are already over here What's weird is that she's here. There's a bunch of enemies here now. Hello Nice to see you kids here to swap out your tonic. Oh, yeah, we haven't gotten a tonic So we got our first one here game plus one butterfly health slot Sharon, I mean it's better than not having any there you go great choice. That's a beauty or you I thought it was a beautiful useful tonic all right Cool, and there's just enemies falling around as well, which is sort of weird, but okay. Now, there was other stuff I could do around here. That's sort of the thing. I don't really know how I want to tackle this game when it comes to this. Like, I should maybe just try to go ahead and complete up World 1 before I do anything here, but I want to go ahead and check this out. Last time I was over here, and, um, I believe there's a button up here that I can't quite, I couldn't quite use, right? Well, I should be able to use it now if I don't fall into my doom. So it's right here, and all I need to do is jump and slam, and boom, what is this? Oh, it's gotta be something cool, right? Ooh, capital B's office? What's going on? Did we make it to the final boss already? Quick quag, that call is coming through! All right, <laughs> is it a phone call or a TV call? A little far at the back, a little to the left? There you go, perfect. All right, good enough. Who is he talking to? <laughs> Greetings, sirs. I wasn't expecting your call. Allow me to update you on our progress. Yeah, so he must be talking to a higher up. First, I can confirm that a small portion of our workforce has been unfairly terminated. But please consider the upturn in all the wages we've saved. Okay, so he's definitely talking to somebody higher up. Uh-oh. Bunch of scary business guys. So capital B ain't the boss. I promise there's no reason to be concerned, Mr. Chairman of the board. Oh boy, it's the chairman. That's not good. I obtained the one book on schedule and its escaped pages will soon be in our grasp. Oh, I don't know if they'll be happy if the pages escaped. I assure you gentlemen, the freakish duo have no idea what they're really up to. Once the book is full of pages, we'll be able to control them and the entire world. Hmm. Okay. I <laughs> like the duck at the bottom. He's just like, man, this is heavy. How long do these guys are blabbermouths? Bye. Blast! This deal gets worse by the quarter minute. I'm not looking forward to them turning up in the f in future games. Oh boy, the sequel already being talked about. Dr. Quack, it's time to ra radicalize our outlook. We need to slow down the intruder's progress. Any ideas? Hmm. Well, sir, I, I do have the, these really nasty quiz questions. Oh, no. An evil quiz? Perfect. No, no, don't tell me there's actually going to be an evil quiz. That's why you get paid slightly above minimum wage, Quack. Get to it. Poor Quack. I feel like he works way harder than his pay grade allows. Oh well, not my problem. You know, he can quit any time. Hybrid Tower, so where is this gonna lead now that we've gotten that fancy cutscene? Whoa, Dr. Quack's quiz time. How fitting. Welcome, welcome, I'm your host, Dr. Quack. Look, lady, this must be Capital B's big hench manager. If big was the requirement, this guy doesn't seem to fit the bill, I reckon he'd be, he, he'd let us pass if we lobbed him a breadcrumbs oh gosh silence I see you've been trespassing illegally inside of my scientific book worlds and now you'll pay the penalty with the terrifying quackfire quiz the what you'll need to provide ten correct answers in order to survive my awful question assault oh my I think that we shouldn't do this just yet, though. Answer a question correctly and I'll allow you to progress forward, but get one wrong and you'll lose a life. Lose all three lives and it's back to the start. <laughs> the cl they cruelly blew the budget on the proper boss battles. Yikes. Now step forward and prepare for a trivia trouncing. Yeah, not quite yet. No, I don't want to do this yet. I'm gonna lose. I don't know anything, unless it's like not about the game. The irrelevant dinosaur Rexter. I don't even know who Rexter is. I thought this might have been like a cool place where I could get like a free pagey. Um, can I quit? All right, well, I'm just gonna play coin. That was right. Oh gosh, I'll be going to the final boss right now. A lucky yes, surely. 
I mean, maybe this isn't the only quiz. Maybe this is actually like a lock to a different area. Those ghastly ghost writers. Which did you capture first in Tribal Stack Tropics? Well, I caught the, the I don't know her name. Uh, Evie Green, Heidi Blue. I don't even remember what color they were. There was not red. Maybe it was green? Yeah, I was right. I'm gonna get them all right, watch me. Humph, <laughs> bring on the next question. I really, like, I don't know. I'm feeling weird about this situation. We're almost there, we're getting closer. The picture, where was it taken? What what picture? I have no clue, dude. I'm gonna say travels or trousers kitchen, the Duke's temple. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. What is this? Wrong! I bet your pub quiz team is the worst. Probably because I don't have one. It's probably the worst if it doesn't exist. That crumbling sea ship you call home. What flies from the mast? A flag? Maybe? Oh, I didn't even. I didn't actually. I was trying to skip the text! <laughs> I should have made these hard. Yeah, you really should have if I accidentally chose it. Gosh darn. Double curses, a super quick correct answer. That's a two pointer, really? Cause I accidentally selected something, I could skip two? Oh my gosh. That's good to know though. Let's see, the ridiculous cloud nimble, where can she be found in tribal stack tropics? I don't know what the area is called. Um, inside Duke's temple by the riverbed. That was right, okay that one had to be quick, right? Could we really get to the end when not knowing like most of this stuff? Flaming foul, these are clearly too easy. Oh, that wasn't a double? No, that was a double, look at it. Oh my gosh, we could actually win. Let's see, the deceitful salesman trouser. How many quills does he require for his very first move? Five, well no, 30, because the first one was free. Oh, zero. Oh yeah, the first one's free, it's zero. Humph, bring on the next question. If they put on 30, I would've gotten it wrong. All right, if we could get, no, we, we got another double. Oh my gosh. Those bogus butterfly boosters. How many have you stolen so far? Butterfly boosters? You like the butter? Zero? I was right. God, why did I make these multiple choice? <laughs> oh my gosh. And did we, no, we, we won. Where, where does this lead? Blast the presentation slides for this quiz. Clearly pitched it as impossible. Oh, something there. Uh, no matter, I'll make sure the next quiz is so tough that even a player's guide won't help you. Oh gosh, good, good thing I haven't bought one. Until next time, dimwits. <laughs> you shouldn't be laughing because you lost, but okay. We're going in wherever this leads. So was it a complete fluke that I was able to survive that? We'll find out soon enough, Hivory Towers. Okay, so it doesn't look like this is the very end of the game. I was, I'm gonna go a little bit farther, but if not, I'm gonna go back, because this isn't really what I wanted. Oh, ow, okay, these guys take multiple hits. Oh gosh, what are these things? I'm not feeling this right now. I'm glad that we can, oh, there's an arcade in there, whoa! I feel like, I thought that maybe it would be like, oh hey, now you can unlock this area, here's a PG. But that's obviously not quite the deal. So I'm gonna explore this area later, don't worry. Well, we don't have to do this quiz again, hopefully, and that'll make it easier for us, but, in the meantime, I'm just gonna head back. I should be able to free this pagey. Hey out there, did you know that you can click L to ent enter aiming mode and look around? That will surely come in handy. Actually, you guys let me know in the comment section about that. I don't need your help, pagey, because the comment section is amazing. Thank you commenters who you know let me know about that because that is actually going to make this a little easier for me. Um, so where is a fire plant? Or maybe I can lick up this torch? I cannot, so let's see if we can't find a plant around here. Oh, there it is, it's right there in plain sight. Okay, so what I think I need to do is lick that up and then go into aiming mode like this and do, oh, oh, I'm not quite close enough. That's awkward. All right, well, I guess I don't really need to aim for this one, right? Am I not doing, okay, there you go. P, A, no, that's that's E, I need G. G, Um. I. Hold on. Oh no, I ran out. I ran out of juice. Hold on. Yep. And then get back up here. I. Ow. <laughs> and then finally. E. Come on. E. E. Yeah. Okay, we did it. Pagey has been saved out of the caging. Rain. Let's go and get you. Where are you gonna be? You're gonna be over here. 
I still can't believe there's like no fancy like dance for whenever you click the page, but I think I'll be able to get over it. It just takes me a long time. Okay, so there's that done. Also, is there anything on top of those pillars? Doesn't look like it. Okay then, so there's another page you done though. I'm glad we got that out of the way. I definitely wanna hop back into the area though and enjoy some more Tribal Stack Tropics. So one thing I wanna do is, I still haven't fed this ghost here. So let's go ahead and do this. Run back over here. And oh, oh. also somebody made a good comparison that these ghosts are actually like Jiggies and I totally agree. Um, There you go. I fed him and that made him green. Look at that, so now we've gotten the second ghost out of this area, and they really are like Jiggies. Like, I mean, they just sort of perform exactly the same. Okay, so there's another area done. Now I'm just trying to figure out what else we could do. There's definitely a quill up here that I'll definitely go and grab. Seems like there's like a ton of stuff, which is really cool. I mean, we've just like, we've only sort of reached the surface of this area. Is this a button? Ooh, button. Ooh. Uh-oh, is that gonna open? That's definitely, wait, it, did, it didn't open. Oh boy. This is gonna be tough, I got 14 seconds to get through everything, whoa, whoa. No, and once you leave that, oh man, once you leave that mode and you fall, you can't get back into it, which is tough. I'll have to try that again. Oh gosh. So I still, I still can't get over that I'm playing this game right now, by the way. um, Since episode two, the game has launched, and I hope everybody who's gotten the game has enjoyed it so far, no matter what console you're playing it on. I mean, this is just one of the many games, you know, I've been wanting to play this year. This and probably um, Crash Remastered have topped my list. Oh, there we go, we did it! Not a problem, not too bad at all. But yeah, this and Crash Remastered are probably some of the top ones on my list when it comes to what I'm super duper excited for, like top five most anticipated games of the year. So I'm glad that we're slowly making our way through that, you know, this list. And I'm glad that you guys are enjoying the series so far. Those of you who've been watching it have said that you really like it and you wanna see more and I appreciate that. All right, let's go ahead and whop, whop. Yep. No, I missed it again! Come on, oh, oh, okay, I, I got lucky, lucky there, so that's good. Hmm, so what else can I do around here? I can hop up here, which is cool. We've done this flower area here. We have not gone and seen this arcade, though. And that's starting to make me curious, so we're probably gonna go and check out that now. I'm just sort of trying to scope out everything. This leads up there, which we have explored, but the thing is, is there's supposed to be an upgrade up there that we've yet to find for, you know, this thing right here, so that's weird. Hmm. How do, how do I best get up there? I guess just sort of traveling up this would make the most sense, right? Looks like it, looks like it. Oh, because this bridge is sort of destroyed, but not enough for me not to be able to cross this. So what is this? Is this Rextro? This Rextro guy they're talking about? Hello, you're cute. Hello there, strange polygonal dinosaur. Are you sure you're in the right game or decade? Hello, my name's Rextro. I hear to, uh, I hear, oh, wait, okay, wait. Is that a typo or is he just talk funny? I here to showcase my amazing arcade games. Rex Joe lonely now though. Yeah, he just sort of talks like a Neanderthal. Friends all vanish to play on a, on a line. Rex Joe plays single player games until friends come back. How long have you been waiting for your friends, Rex Joe? Since 1997, but sure they will be here soon. Poor Rex Joe. No wonder you, your blocky game characters went extinct. Well, Rextro crowdfunded return. Got cool old school games to play. Rextro had to borrow assets from other games, but don't tell. Oh gosh. Friends will need play coin to make arcade g work. Rextro sure ha he has saw one near here. We don't have a play coin yet, Rextro, but um, we dropped one nearby. We'll just go fetch ours. Radical, come back when you found play coin. Oh. I don't quite have a play coin, so I don't know where we're gonna get one, but I can get up here. Pretty cool platforming. Um, but I can't really get up here. Hmm. So I wonder where we can find a play coin. Hopefully somewhere in this level, it'd be sort of a bummer if we couldn't. I mean, maybe a character will give us one, like uh, the cloud? I don't know if the cloud is even supposed to give us a jiggy. Or not a jiggy, <laughs> the wrong game. A pagey. I don't know. The only other thing I'm trying to figure out is that there is not, like there's a few things, like I'm just like really clueless on what exactly I'm supposed to be able to do. Oh, this one raises, it does not fall. What is up here? Oh, hello, oh you're one of these creepy bees again. Hello creepy bee, hiya, ow that hurt. Um, what are you doing? No, leave me alone, you know what? Oh gosh, no, there was no platform there yet. Oh darn it. All right, let's try this one more time. And there's also this one right over there. I still have no clue how to do that. So once you activate, okay, so I tried doing this and I fell fell and I died. Looks like once you activate it, it actually stays there forever. 
or at least an incredibly long time. And then let's just do that. That one actually wasn't bad, that was a really easy page. I'm glad we got that one. Okay then, so let's go back this way. Let's see what we can do. Well, let me just try to punch, yep, there we go. See, this is the one I'm like super duper stuck on because I just don't understand why it's not working. Maybe at some point we could find out, but the guy's just a total jerk. There's also another flower I ran by that I haven't talked to, so I think I'll do this and see if I can um, talk to him and maybe he'll give me like a significant tip. All right, then, so I talked to the flower and basically said that there's another ghost hiding behind a pig somewhere. I don't know if it's the original pig we found or a different pig. We'll have to find out at some point. It's just weird because I feel like there's a lot to do, but not a lot of ways to do it. So it's like, it's weird because I'm trying to figure out what would be good to do right now, especially since, ah, um, inside the monument. Oh, hello. Okay, so this is, what, what's going on here? So if I could maybe become invisible, I'd be able to get through there, but I can't quite do that. Hmm, I wonder if I could shoot this thing instead. <laughs> maybe violence is the answer. Let's see if I can't find maybe a flower nearby and just shoot at that thing. And maybe that'll be better? I don't think so, though. I have a feeling that's not going to have a better effect. Oh, there's even something under here. And let's see this, oh no, okay, these are just quills, but it's still good to get the quills. I'm not gonna complain. How is our quill count doing right now, by the way? Let me uh, beat up some of these crates that have nothing in them. They, they at least have some butterflies, but um, when it comes to our totals, if we go to, not hybrid towers, but right here in Travel Stack Tropics, we have more than half the quills, which is good. I have a feeling that there's not too much more we can do in this area until we get more abilities from Trousers, but she doesn't have any more abilities for this area, so maybe next round, uh, next area, I can go and try to find out. Also, what is down here? There is a dude, and he is just, he's another air conditioner guy. How do I lower the water enough to get down here? Good question, I don't know the answer, because it wouldn't let me lower. Remember I tried that last episode, where I tried to hit him with fire when he was already dry, and it didn't do anything. So I'm very scatterbrained so far in today's episode, and I apologize for that if it's frustrating to watch and stuff, but I'm gonna climb up this tower and try to get myself up here, because now that I know how to properly aim, I can go ahead and figure this out and get up the to, to the top of this tower, and I really hope that there's actually something to do with the top of this tower, because I feel like that keeps happening to me. I'll find out how to do something, I'll make this big advancement where I'm traversing, and then I'll just get to the top, oh no, you need 30 other things. It's just like, I feel like I'm making no progress right now, and it's just pain in the booty. All right, so I hope this is good enough. I'll let you in on a secret. Since I'm playing on PC, I actually just used the mouse and keyboard and it was significantly easier. Look at this, okay, there's a bunch of eyeballs. Oh, these guys are the worst. I'm just gonna get rid of them as quickly as I can. There's another one over here. Oh, get out of here, dude. Come on, get, get, get going. There you go. So what do we do here? Um, I'm gonna guess we have to hit that gem looking thing with this, or just go like this and boom. That did something. I got myself a fancy gem. Yeah, <laughs> that really feels like Spyro. Great work, friends. You retrieved my jewel, now bring it back in. Okay, hold on. Oh, don't make a mistake. Okay, yeah, oh, okay, that hurt, but that's okay. I'm totally fine with it. <laughs> Pick me up, Yuka. And where are you, Shovel Knight? How you doing, dude? Blimey, check out this guy, Yuka. We already talked to him. Greetings, adventure on the other. I know, I know, we, we've already acquainted. Do you mean this treasure? Yeah, finally. Wait, you've already been up there without consulting me for adventuring tips? Impressive, I actually have talked to you, you just forgot. Uh, give us something harder next time, your knightliness. Oh. It was actually quite difficult. I'll keep that in mind now as we, as promised, here's the secret to adventuring success. He has no clue. Um, what? He's, oh, he's, he's digging Pagey up. Okay, there you go. All you need is a map and the thirst for adventure. <laughs> this guy's humor is as flat as pixelated as his pixelated treasure. Wow, yikes! There you go. Give me that PG. That's another one done. Well, you guys are doing great. We'll have the one book returned and and filled in no time. Cool. I have no idea what else I can actually do in this area. Remember, you can choose to expand worlds by returning to the Grand Tome entrance. All right, well, I've already expanded this world unless I can expand it again. But I think I might go ahead and try to find a new world now. Like, I feel like that might be my best option. Because honestly, there's, like I said, I don't really know too much about what I can do around here right now. Because right now it doesn't seem like too much, but what is that down there? 
There is an area snuck under here. So there seems to be lots more to find, for sure. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. I love all of this kind of stuff. Like, this is cool. These secret little nooks and crannies are fun. Um, boop, got that. And then what is inside of here? Oh, hello, ghost. Yay, I can just pick you up. Hi, orange dude. Well, there's another one done. I'm glad to see. Well, let's get back up here. Hmm. I don't see anywhere else I can do. Well, let's go ahead and try to, I don't know. Uh, I want to go to the next area. I just don't know if it's the right choice. Ooh, is there something in here as well? Or sort of under one of the pillars? Ooh, there is. Like, I don't mean to come across as wishy-washy in the series, because I want to be able to like stick to a world. But I know that a lot of people said in this game that like when playing it, Rampo's treasure chamber. Ooh, ooh, I like it. More quills, which is what I'm looking for. And of course a KG pagey, but I don't know how to open you up, dude. Hmm. I actually have no clue. Um, I don't see anything in here that I could actually open you with. Usually there's like some puzzle nearby. So maybe there is a way to get you open, I just don't know quite yet. But yeah, um, a lot of people were telling me as, as advice for this game, if there's something it seems like you can't do, you probably can't yet, and you have to go come back once you have something else. And it's like I'm trying to heed that advice and I'm starting to run out of things to do, which means probably most things that I'm running into, I just can't do in this area anymore. So maybe if I move on to a new area, I just don't know if that's really the case or not. I wanna get up here now, so let's try to get across. I'm just sort of trying to follow the quills right now, to be honest. It seems to be helping. I'm starting to find new things just by trying to look for the quills, because I'm more than halfway done with them all. And that's a good set of progress, in my opinion. But there's like secret stuff tucked away in places I wasn't really expecting, which is pretty crazy. It's, it's well scoped out in that way. Oh, I didn't see this one before. I definitely didn't see this one before over here. I didn't know there was a nice one. This one's sort of tucked away compared to those two. So let me try the ice one. And this one doesn't do anything to him. Really? Come on, take it. <laughs> What if I go ahead and give him water and then maybe I can make it hell? Like maybe that's a better idea? Or maybe I just need to talk to him again before I can actually start giving him stuff here. Now he's gonna start raining. Hmm, that vapor went straight through. Nimbo. That's cool, but why isn't the ice working? I don't know, I'll have to give it a shot. Like, now it's all water, and it makes like a like a failure noise. It doesn't really make like a good noise, you know? But what if we freeze up now? Just like that. It, it, the frozen air thing here obviously has something. It, it's not useless, uh-oh. Hmm, chili! That caused a movement. Okay. So now it's gonna all freeze up. Oh, maybe this is how I could win against What's-Her-Face. No, it makes a defeat sound, like that's not what I want. And now if I melt it again, it'll probably turn back to water, right? Or maybe it'll just turn to heat, I'm not really sure. But there's interesting combinations I can do here. Dang it, I felt. So this is all frozen up though. There we go. It's gonna go back to running. Of course, of course, holding that in for ages. You mean like five minutes at most? And then as soon as I can, and it makes a failure noise again. So I'm gonna try it one more time and just try to dry him up. No, I can't, cause it, oh, oh, maybe that's what the noise is. It isn't, I mean, it isn't like a noise saying that I failed the puzzle, it's a noise saying my power up is over. Ah, that's probably a lot more likely, and I'm just an idiot. <laughs> I don't know where I just fell down from, but I just fell all the way down from like the, okay, I know where I fell down from, I don't know where I fell down into. Somewhere, because where does this lead? Hold on. Where is it, where exactly, is this gonna get, what, where, where am I? Hello, how are you? Hello there, who might you be? Howdy strangers, name's Kratos, <laughs> like Kratos. Let me guess, the god of ore? Ah, no, or Av, no, oh, okay. It's Av, like I have, I've no idea what y'all be bragging about, myth. <laughs> It just like sounds like he has a mouthful of marbles. My job's to ride rails in the grand tomes and bring back gold. Though I've not had much treasure in a long time, nobody cares for us minecart fellas no more. Oh, you're in the wrong game. You should go to Minecraft. Sorry, what'd you say? I wasn't paying attention. 
<laughs> nice to meet you, Cardos. We're searching for pages. Do you think we'll find any on your tracks? You'll find plenty when you're all inside, my boy. There's gold in them. There, are mine, chaps. <laughs> Say, how about y'all critters? Be my partner on the ride. Sure. Sure thing, Cartos. We'll give it a try. So I don't know how I'm gonna get to this area normally, but I fell from the area where I got the air conditioner paging. Oh boy, just like the old days. It's like Donkey Kong. If you want to rustle yourselves a pagey, you'll be needing to collect 60 gems on a track before y'all reach the end. Do you need to know the controls, Curtis? Yes. Um, you'll need to be A to jump, X to fire, L to boost, or break. I'm guessing it's like side-scrolling then. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea how I got here. Come on, ready, set, jump. Oh gosh, this is really weird. Okay, the breaking and stuff, I'm not sure how big of a fan I am of, like the, the boosting and breaking, it just sort of feels weird. Here, jump. Okay, break. Oh, I don't know if there's like health at all or something. Oh yeah, just maybe I should start shooting a little more often. I guess you don't really get like many shots is the problem. Oh boy. Well, how many did I need to get? Because I think I got, I've gotten 50 so far. I don't think it was like 100 that he said. So I think I've done well so far. Ow, that hurt. We'll get those as much as I can. Here, get that, ooh, that's pretty good. I mean, this is my first try doing this. Ow, that hurt. Oh gosh, I'm so hard. Sorry, Kartos. I'm sure this hurts a lot. I mean, you're probably taking just as much of the brunt of the damage as we are, but, oh jeez, it's quite a lot at this point, ain't it? Oh boy, oh. Oh, oh, hey, look, little ring. Yeah, okay, we made our way to the end. We're all the way back here now. Yeehaw, nice one, partners. I guess he's supposed to be like Southern. I don't know, it's really weird to tell him. Let's see. Hoo-wee, I guess he is supposed to. These years made me feel like a young minecart again. Ugh, I think a dusty old car has given me a rash. Thanks for showing me an old, uh, an old car a good time. Here's your pagey. Nice, that one wasn't too bad. Now we're back here. Good, because I don't know how I got here. What is, what is, what is this? Uh, I have no clue. Maybe somebody needs cannonballs? Whoa, whoa, it's a bit windy up here. All right, well, not, something else we can't do. So this is the end, the dead end area. So let's find out where this stems from, because I am just like majorly confused. Because I fell down from up. Like I just sort of saw a platform, like I don't think I've been here. But I fell down from up there, and there's like a whole set of like cages, I don't even know. So first off, where does this lead? Maybe somewhere I've been and I just completely neglected it because I'm a dingus butt? I think so. I, I, yeah, I think so. I think this is where I normally go up, and then I go into there, and yeah, okay, so I just didn't pay attention to the fact that there's a second trail over here. That's crazy. Like, I don't know, just so much to see and to do. Don't know how to handle it. Can I climb up this, or is this like an ability I won't have until later as well? Let's see. It's all a fishy symbol. I don't know what the fishy symbol exactly means. Uh, but yeah, okay, I, I don't know if I had to climb this like grating. It looks like I don't have to. Anything behind here, not looking like it. I'll get up here though, get on this platform. Oh, what is this? Uh, look, it's me, the amazing health extender. Collect us to extend your health. Oh, can I like wall jump up there at some point? Really not sure. And we got ourselves a health extender, so on top of our tonic that we got earlier in the episode, we've already gotten two health extensions, which is pretty nice. But I think that's about it for here. So now it's just another dead end, I guess. Okay, so let's try to race you again now. Let's see, my racetrack, it's rock solid. Oh yeah, I guess she notices. That's probably something to do with the cold we have, we gave your uncle. Oh, a strong Camulo Nimbus like him will be just fine. What just say, what say we take advantage of ourselves? A nice race. Sure. Uh, go on then, we're not afraid of icy track conditions, especially since I won't be the one touching the floor. Okay. Well, we can try this. May see if it's any easier or more difficult. I'm sure we can figure out pretty darn quickly. Um, let's see. One lap through the, all the gates, wins, let's go. And then jump! Oh no, she's already knocked me over! Hold on, you get back here! So far this is not starting off as well, I can tell you that much. I mean, she floats over everything no matter what, water, you know, ground, or, you know, ice here. 
So it's just like, it's not really a problem for her, it's exactly the same, and she is just blasting away. So I think this is also going to be a loss for us. Okay, so I obviously lost that race. The last thing I wanna do is go ahead and get this one quill that's been taunting me every time I go by here. Just like that. So I honestly been searching this place high and low, and I can't find too much more we can do right now to get more stuff. And it's really confusing me what we could do beyond go to a new area and buy new abilities from Chowser that might help us here. So I figure that's gonna be my next goal. So let's go and see if we can't find a new area. And also go back to the cannon guy, back at the tutorial, and just try to figure that stuff out. One thing I haven't tried is getting up here. And I know, I know, I said I was gonna go to the next area. I will in a second. But look, there's quills up here. This is something I was supposed to do. At least in some, you know, form. Doesn't look like there's too much beyond that, but I'm glad I gave it a try. Doesn't look like there's anywhere to go the opposite direction for right now. Don't know about up there. We'll find out, we'll find out in due time. But for right now, I'm gonna go to the next area or at least go back to the tutorial area and get a free pagey. All right, mister. You will receive some help now. So, oh yeah, so I already talked to him like this. Don't need to do this again. This was a silly mistake. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, Curse slam a lamb on you. And that worked, yeah, okay. So there's another pagey for us. We're making some decent pagey progress today. <laughs> I can't breathe, I, I, I can breathe, thank you. I knew it was that yellow newspaper. Grab that and pop it in the recycling. Would you? <laughs> well, I won't recycle it, but I will use it. Can I hit you again? I can, but not too much happens. Anything else you can tell me? Thanks again for clearing my throat. You should probably stay away from Dirty Dave's dubious donners. But they're so good. All right, see you, dude. Um, Beyond that, is there anything else we can do in this tutorial area? I might run around and see if we can't find out. We can now go up here, but from my knowledge, it's largely useless. There's nothing up there. Um, I don't see too much around here. So let's go ahead and try it. We'll try it real quick. There's even baddies that run around here now. They've, uh, you know, infested our home. I don't appreciate it. I mean, it's, it's not as bad as, you know, vegetables with eyeballs that are giant, but it's still pretty bad. Yeah, if I get up here, oh, there's a pagey up here now. There was not a pagey up there when I have previously checked game, but I'm glad there's one up there now. Um, well, if that's all I can, I'm gonna guess that, that might be all I can do. We're, right now we have 10 pages, if I view my totals and we go here, and I've gotten four out of 20, 10 out of 10, and a bunch of other stuff, okay. Sounds good. And if I, I can't, I, I can't go in first person up here. All right, well then, that might be the extent though. I think that really is just about the most I can find around here. So there's a water plant here. And is there anything that the needs particularly to be cooled down? Don't exactly see anything. Obviously there's actually little water pockets around here quite a lot. But I don't see anything that would need to be watered down. Maybe we'll find something at some point or you know something might pop up. For right now though, there is an area beyond this first level that I've been you know, eyeballing that I wanna check out now, which is of course up here. I'm running out of energy though, so I gotta be careful. Oh, get up here, and maybe this won't lead anywhere. Or maybe it will? I hear it shimmering as if there was a pagey up there or something of value. Why is my energy not restoring? I'm not sure. We got up here again. Uh, your amateur moves aren't worth a dime for a change I made this taunt rhyme. Thanks, dude. Maybe I'm just supposed to go across here? I hear the glimmering of something worthwhile. It's up there. Okay. How can I get in there? Maybe I could just boop, 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 boop. I love how he'll chime in, though. It's just like uh, Gruntilda. I called her Grunty before, and I guess that's not her name. I don't think I can do this. <laughs> Doesn't look like I can actually do anything here. I mean, I can't break this, not quite like this. I didn't see any flowers I could eat up. That would at least give me a projectile to do anything with. There is something, ah, up there. Don't know if I can quite get up there though. Hmm, okay. Another area I can't do anything with. I guess I'll try going back to the quiz area we unlocked. Maybe there'll be a second world there. Also, one more thing. I know, I keep running up and down, back and forth, but it's like, I just don't know what else to do sometimes. Gotta try different things. Press the button again, nothing happens. Good to know. Oh, right here. Okay, let's go and do that. Ready, lick. Go, 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 go. I need to remember to listen for that shimmer. If I can listen for that, I should be good to go. There is another pagey down. 
a lot of pages. Like I said, there's an insane amount of pages in this game. Like, how many pages are in total? 145, so we have found 15 out of 145, so a little more than one tenth. We're getting somewhere. Hey, sir, sir, get out of here. Excuse me, pardon me. So what is down this, this is where there's like a little ice. I don't know what I could freeze, but there might be something worth freezing. And then we got this whole like production facility. They're like flat, they're, they're flattening wood into paper. They turn the paper into stacks of paper. Oh, this is all books. So they're turning everything into books, okay. These guys take two hits now. And they're, they're the real deal. Okay, just trying to look around. It's good to look around, get an understanding of our surroundings before we do anything else. There's something Rexto related here that I gotta check out for sure. These guys are pushing everything around. They're rude. Ah, look at that. Here we go, there's something to get into here. Good, whoa, hey. Letters, evil letters. Hi, Rexto, save me from this. Thanks for visiting, play now before it gets shut down for underpeers. Oh, okay, can I play any of this stuff? Wait, I can. This is amazing Rexro software entertainment. Do friends want to play fun arcade game? Sure, we'll play a arcade game, just one. Just one. Because we gotta do other things. Maybe this will actually get me something, I don't know. This is the gun, the gun tlitz run? All right, we'll shoot corplets, grab power-ups, get the score, the high score. I can shoot and I can jump. Uh, take to track and blast corplets and chaos filled shoot 'em up. Rex do not like bangs, so watch from afar. Is this like Sonic the Hedgehog? It sort of is, but it's a really slow Sonic the Hedgehog. So it's not too far off. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. So I can shoot these guys though. This feels like a little big planet level actually with how sort of cheesy it is. Like I know that's sort of on purpose for it to be cheesy, but that cheesiness makes it feel like a little big planet level. This, like, once again, I feel like I'm actually gonna, you know what, I wanna go ahead and do this with mouse. Oh no, it's not letting me do it with mouse and keyboard. Huh, okay, usually lets me do most things with mouse and keyboard, but not this time. All right, well, we're doing so far so good. Oh, I missed one, there you go, I got him, don't worry. All right, well, we're doing okay so far. Oh no, we did miss a guy over there, though. Oh no, that stinks. Oh gosh, now there's moving people. Oh, we got you still, though. Oh, no, wait, I can get up here, and bada boom, I got rapid fire, go, 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 go. Oh boy. And maybe like getting a really good high score will get me something, maybe it'll get me one of those play tokens. That way I can unlock another arcade game back at the place. Oh, we took our first bit of damage. We're about to plop back down. Um. Oh, I gotta choose where I wanna plop down now. All right, well, we're doing okay so far, 5,000 points. It's sort of a quickly, Tedious game mode though, like I, like I get it, game. You know, they just run and shoot. This is a grenade shot, whoa. Um, doesn't seem to be doing too much. Okay, now it is. Oh, it's already over. Oh, come on, that wasn't very satisfying. Gosh, man, it just keeps going forever. Oh wait, there's the end. There is the end, we actually made it. Oh gosh, oh, I hope we did good, because I don't really want to do this one again. Like, it was fun one time. Probably not too much any more than that. Okay. Do friends want to play again? No. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, yeah, so it doesn't really allude to me getting anything for it. There are tons of these everywhere, though. Some of them are huge. Oh, this one's, I need to find a way to break glass because there is another pagey hiding in this one. Yeah, that seems to be about it for this area. Okay, well, that was a fun little experience, if, if nothing else, so I'm glad to see we had that. I'm gonna beat up these letters. No, I said I'm gonna beat up the letters. Thank you. Oh, look, here, hey, here's trousers. Hey, dude. What's up? Ah, my good pals, back for more of my fantastic offers? Sharon, no, you're blocking the route to the next world. Oh yeah, the next world is down there, I can see the book. Well, I reckon you'll be needing one of my top shelf moves to get beyond this cavernous gap. And for helping me expanding my sales to Tribal Stack Tropics, it's free of charge. Ooh, well, if it's going to cause, or if it's going, going for nothing, this next move will allow for purple friend here to glide through the sky with a hold of A. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Simply leap into the air with A and then press and hold A a second time to glide. That sounds useful. I hope you're up to the task lately. I had a big breakfast. Oh my. <laughs> Notice what these things, or these wings are something. Super, come and find me in the archive later. I have something off, off the books to offer you. The archive? Hold on, how do I get my move down? Um, 
No returns. Oh, forgotten already. Simply leap. Okay, so I can I can just do it now. There was like no animation or anything. So I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, uh, er, go. Let's do this. There you go. Actually, wow, that's quite the amount of glide too. I thought I saw the book down here. Guess I didn't. My eyes are deceiving me. I'll be going back in a second though. More of these cannonballs. I can't look these up, but once I can. I can only imagine I can do some awesome stuff with them. Cause I found them several times now. Oh gosh, I think our next area is an icy area. Interesting. I can't quite get across to there. And was there a PG flying around in that tube? Yes, there is. <laughs> it's zipping on by. And there's, oh gosh, this guy doesn't look pleasant. Can I even get past him? Maybe if I, yep, fly real quick. We got bees. Should we anger the bees? Um, I, I could. There's so much stuff around here that I can do but I don't know how to yet. Um, you'll need three of us pages to unlock this world. Yeah, sure, we'll unlock it for now if not anything else. But I think there's like a boss per every area too and I don't wanna skip out on that kind of stuff. I'm just so confused. I'm glad we're making some kind of progress though. Like at least we're not running around doing nothing. It's just not a lot of stuff. Don't forget you can choose to expand this world once you've found five pages, just stand on the grand tome. All right then, I hear the expanded version of Glitter Grace Grazier introduces different perspective. Should I do that now? Maybe I have to get five pages within that world. Maybe that's something we'll save for next episode. Last thing I wanna do is go back and open up that one secret area. Can I plop down here or is this too foggy? No, I can go down here. So what is the point of down here? Uh, I see some boxes. I don't see too much else. I'll come back. So I'm gonna lick this up and just start rolling, 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 rolling. Rolling, 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 rolling. And then just start shooting like crazy so I don't have to aim up and hopefully hit one of them. And then what's gonna be in here? There's a book at the top. It looks like it might actually be like some kind of library. It looks fancy. It's made out of like pure marble stone or something. What could it be? What could it be? It is a library, look at that. The archive. Oh, this is what he was talking about. So this is the archive. There's some weird stuff going on in here. I don't know how I feel about it. There's an arrow pointing. What are, what are you pointing at? Uh, I mean, usually those are the arrows pointing the way to, you know, Rex's arcade. Now they're pointing there. And there's eyeballs arguing. This is like a whole museum as well. Oh, but I can go in here. Where's, hold on, hold on. Where's Trousers at? Is Trousers up here? Let's try to get up here and see if I can't find Trousers. Trousers, buddy. Where are you? Are you in here at all? Uh, well. I can't do whatever this is. Maybe if I found a water slam or maybe found something that drains that water. Trouser said he'd be here, so it's quite odd that he isn't here quite yet. But let's try to find our way through here. Oh my, instantly teleports me. Where does this door lead? Oh, for a second I thought we already found it. I was like, that was quite easy. Hey, hey, sir, sir, get out of here. Man, I'm so bad at beating things up in this game. Uh, Oh, we're back here again. Hold on, what? Go through here. It just plops me off here. Oh no, because I want, no, no, okay. Where am I now? I'm back at the entrance. What? So it just plops me off here. If I go through here, it brings me here, which that's what this does. So if I go through here, it all leads me in a big circle. What? Oh, okay, so I can get up here. There's like an open ceiling. So this one will bring me here in front of these. <laughs> does that spell P? That spells P. These guys are jokes, these are very appropriate. And now we're down here. Where does this one lead? This one leads, oh, oh wait, leads here. And just, what? It keeps knocking me back because there's a book in the way. Oh, come on, game. That's silly. Oh, look at that, I found it! Well, at least I got that going on for me. And that is gonna open up a secret entrance in here. Which just leads back to the beginning. Okay, and like, Trouser's not in one of these, right? And I'm just like getting confused. Doesn't look like it. All right, well, Trouser's a big fat liar because he said he'd be here. You know, liar, liar, pants on fire, which is a big deal for Trouser. Like, I feel like he's supposed to be right here, but he's not spawning in for some reason. Maybe we'll find out in the next episode, but I think that's where we're gonna be finishing it off for today's episode of Ukulele. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment gliding zebra so that you've watched in the video and that you are a zebra-tastic viewer. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.